We're going to do an unboxing of the Sea Eagle Easy Cart. Sea Eagle sent this to me last week. I guess they heard all the complaining I was doing about uh, how heavy my TC16 is. And so this device is used to place under the back of the canoe. It's two wheels, it's a long rod, and you can pull it down to your trail. So let's open it up. All right. First thing it comes with is a instruction and owner's manual. Well, there's not much to it. Aluminum, it's nice and light. So that must be the center bar. One of the axle bars. Second axle bar. A couple of wheels. Seem pretty significant, that's nice. And a uh, little strap. Has a weight limit of 125 pounds. Not recommended for our heaviest boats. Well, mine's only 65 pounds, so I think we're good. All right, so basically it's slide one washer over the axle of the wheel frame. All right, so we need to take these rings off. One washer on. Place the wheel on, put the other washer on, and then put our ring through the hole. And everybody who has seen my TC16 video knows how much I love putting these rings on. Hey, those are actually pretty easy. Okay. So that's one. That's two. All right. If you notice, well, if we can see that, looks like it's not quite long enough. And so the washer covers it over. Maybe the washer can go the other way. Let's see. Let's see if the washers are different. Aha. Uh -huh. The directions do say to push the red bearing down if not fully seated. So slide the wheel onto the axle. Note, push the red bearing down if not fully seated. So maybe this red washer here is not pushed, or not seated all the way. So let's see if we can push it in a little bit. That is not budging. All right, so this bearing on the inside of the wheel needed to be banged down just a little bit. So I took a wooden block, placed it over the top, and there's a little bit of a rests on top of this raised area on the bearing. And then I whacked it down with the hammer. So I put it on the ground and I just gave it a bunch of wax. It really took a lot of wax to get it down. But now, this should fit. Let's put the bearing on. Let's put that on. Washer. Ah, still doesn't fit. All right, no matter how much I bang this, it doesn't seem to be going down. This needs to be bending the wood. Maybe I can just whack it right on there. Do I dare? Sure. Actually, let's put a towel over it. I'll give it a whack. Oh, and I just broke it. <laughs> Well, it did push it in. Hey, we'll give it a try. See how it works. That seems to hold a little bit more, have a little bit more space there. Oh yeah, that's gonna fit. Okay, so the key is to smash it with a hammer. It seems to spin all right, so that's good. 
All right, next thing I want to do is this is this aluminum bar is all protected with plastic. So let's pull that off. There's something very satisfying with these protective sheets of plastic. I don't know if anyone else is satisfied by this, but I'm guessing there's probably a YouTube channel dedicated to pulling plastic off of new products. <laughs> there seems to be a channel for everything. All right, so it looks like it's adjustable. It's nicely machined. I'm guessing for my boat, I'm gonna have to put it pretty far in. That's one, and that's two. All right, boat sits on there. Strap goes over the top. Let's take a look at that strap, see what kind of a clip it's got at the end. Okay, two straps. That's the unboxing of the Sea Eagle Easy Cart. Next time, we'll uh, blow up the TC16. We'll see how well it works. Thanks for watching.